Hi guys, in this video, I will show you how you can remove a stuck CD in your car CD player. So, I will try to show you at least four or five different methods how you can use it. The first one is to use a blank CD ROM. Now, make sure this CD is the one that you're not using. So, it might get damaged, so you won't be able to use it again. So, make sure that you are willing to uh, dispose this CD afterwards. And all you have to do is basically, you just need to pop into the CD hole. So, here it is. So push it in and just push it in kind of like halfway or one third of the way and then try to wiggle it. And what this does is it will eventually try to get your CD out. And there you go, you can see it pops out the CD. And once it pops out, we can uh, put it back in and hopefully it doesn't get stuck anymore. So why does this method work? Because um, basically the mechanism inside your city sometimes it can get misplaced or whatever happens. Basically you need to wiggle this one around. So what I do is I put the city in and I wiggle the city around and that, move, that makes this city move around the city player and allow the city to pop out, allow the mechanism to unlock and eject the city out of the city player. Okay, with this uh, second uh, method, I'm going to use a plastic card. You can use your old credit cards or any loyalty cards that you no longer use. So I'll put some tapes around and I'm just going to twist it around like that. And I want it to be able to allow the sticky side sit at the front like that. So... As you can see, I'm just going to uh, cut it. Okay, so make sure it's nice and sticky. So the sticky size is this way. You can do all the way down the whole cut if you want. If you have a bigger tape, you can just tape it around this way. And now we, I'm just going to pop it in and then try to wiggle around so that it sticks to the city and we can drag it out. So kind of like push it in. So you need to push it in and wiggle it around. <laughs> now you can see the city kind of like pops out. And we can just kind of like drag it out. And there it is. Okay, method number three is to use uh, a butter knife, a plastic uh, piece, or an ice cream uh, stick, or one of these tools here. So any prying tools that you have at home, you can use. Uh, it doesn't have to be exactly a butter knife. Anything that's nice and flat and strong, we can give it a try. Now again, we can use the double-sided tape or a sticky tape, tape it around. So I'm going to put some tape on and we'll give it a try again. Okay, so I have uh, put some sticky tape on this tool here. So basically just tape it once and then twist it. And then twist around. And uh, we will have a look, see how we can uh, try to pull out the CD. So now make sure the sticky side is over here. So it is sticky as you can see. And now we can just pull, push it in and then wiggle it around. Now, if, once you put in, you can start it here to whine, the, the CD player start to whine or make some noise. So you want to uh, wiggle it around, uh, wiggle it around, allow the CD. So while wigging, also press on the eject button and that helps the CD come out. So there you go. So if it's stuck, give it a wiggle. So put some tape in, wiggle, and then we try to kind of like drag it out at the same time. So kind of like, move it around, push it up and down, and then eject at the same time, and that help get the CD out of place. So again, you can use this or butter knife or another plastic piece of tools. So it doesn't matter which one, you can use anything that's flat and hard, and we can try to drag it out with a thick, sticky tape or double-sided tape. Okay, in this final method, what we need to do is we need to turn off the car now you can see sometimes um, the CD player, it will notice there's an error, so it will automatically uh, pops up the CD, so we don't have to do anything. In other circumstances, 
you may need to uh, disconnect the power supply to the CD player. So there is, uh, depending on which model of the cars you have, there some cars have a, um, a mechanism set in place so that when you disconnect the power source to the CD player, it will try to attempt um, to remove or automatically eject the CD. So after you um, reconnect the battery power to the CD player, it will identify that there's a power source coming in, so it will automatically eject any CD that is stuck inside your CD player. So not all cars will work the same way, but what you can do is just switch off your car, and then now you disconnect the battery terminal. So disconnect the battery terminals and wait for at least 30 seconds to one minute allowing all the battery power to discharge from the CD player then after one minute we connect um, the cables back to the battery then go in your car and turn the car back on and see if the CD player will uh, eject the CD and also try to press on the eject button at the same time and see if that helps and that's it, that is the four different ways you can try to uh, remove your st stock CD from your car radios or uh, your car CD player. Thank you for watching this video, please subscribe to my channel for more videos.